Hello. Um, I decided to make one of those, you know, like about me video type situation things. Um, this is actually the second take because um, the first video I made, I went on for eight minutes straight about it. It, it was bad. Just anyway. Um, um, I'm a very awkward person. I don't, I don't, like, I feel like I'm talking to myself right now and it, it makes me feel very awkward or like, you know, kind of insane. I don't know how, how, how you guys, like, talk to cameras and feel completely comfortable. I don't, maybe, you know, it's something I'll get used to. I don't know. Anyway, I'm very awkward and I, I apologize at how uncomfortable this video will probably be. Um, but my name is Nicole. Nick. Um, my family calls me Nikki. You know, some of the, and it, it's kind of weird because I don't, it's not my favorite. I, I prefer Nicole or Nick, you know, but, um, I'm that yellow bird on Tumblr. Um, I'm 23. I'll be 24 four in a month. Was today like the twenty today's the twenty first, the twenty I don't know what today is, but yeah, less than a month. My birthday's on the eighteenth of November. So but that's that's pretty pretty terrifying to me because you know, I thought like twenty twenty three, okay, it's not so bad. But next is twenty four and that's in less than a month. And then a year from that, I'm going to be 25. I'm, I'm going to, you know, it's... In, in, in the dollar bill of my life, I'll be a quarter. <laughs> that, please pretend I didn't say that because that was really... That, that was kind of weird. Um, but I mean, you know, it's... That's a quarter of my life, and then in 25 years I'll be 50, and it's, I, what have I done with my life so far? I, nothing, nothing, and I mean, I, I want to do, you know, so many things. I mean, I just, <clears throat> excuse me, this is, this is not okay, I'm, anyway. Yeah, I'll be 24 in a month, um, I live with my grandparents. I just moved away from home for the first time, um, 1,500 miles. My parents are in Oklahoma, and um, my parents, my brother, and my dog, I miss them all like crazy. I have never been away from them for longer uh, than, you know, two weeks, and it's, it's a hard adjustment. You know, my mom is my best friend, my brother is my best friend. You know, my dad is, you know, Superman to me, and my dog is my soulmate, so it's, it's very, it's, it's an interesting adjustment. It's, I've grown more in the past six months than I have in the past five years, which, you know, is, is amazing, and I'm grateful for all the experiences I've gone through, but I really, like, I fucking miss my family so much. Um... But yeah, I live in Pennsylvania now with my grandparents, and and that's interesting. Um, my my family's kind of crazy. My grandmother is she's from Thailand, <laughs> and I've got uh, five aunts and uncles, all you know, full blood Thai, and so I I basically I have a crazy Asian family, and I and I mean they're nuts. The food is fucking fantastic. But I, you know, I love them and I've missed them, you know, being so far away from them for so long and I'm, I'm glad to be here, you know, and, and they're hilarious and they, you know, I can be have a, having a really shitty day and they just, I mean, I mean, they make it so much better. They make me laugh and, you know, but anyway, yeah, that's, that's where I am right now. Um... I mean, I'm so, like, ner I was so nervous about doing this video that I actually, like, this is kind of embarrassing, but I made a prompt, like, of, 
in, in case, like, I got stuck and it, it got really, you know, like, weird and there was this long silence because I don't have any video editing software. So this is, like, a one-take kind of deal. So I had to write a list of things that, <laughs> like, I wanted to talk about just so... There wasn't that awkward, you know that awkward silence where, you know, you're trying to have a conversation with somebody and, and you, you just, you run out of topics in your head of things to talk about and you're just sitting there and, you know, you're like, okay, you know, what, what should I say? Are they going to say something first? And not that you're actually, you know, talking back to me, but I, I didn't want to make you feel awkward that, with the silence that I, I could have potentially created and okay we're gonna we're gonna move on from this um let's see i love i love music it 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 has saved my life on many occasions um art art is art is my entire world i i mean i i love photography i've been i've been shooting since i was 12 I got my first film camera when I was 10, um, and then I discovered my, um, my dad's T70, and that, I mean, it, it, it changed my life. I had the best photography teacher in high school, and he really, he pushed me to, to be the best, and I, I mean, he, he graded me harder than all of the other students, which... You know, I appreciate it because <clears throat> he, it, it, it felt like, you know, he, he saw potential in me and, you know, if I were to hand in something subpar, you know, not as good as I could have been, you know, he, he, he recognized it and he, he pushed me and I, I'll, I'll never, he taught me so much. He changed my life and photography is, is my world. It's. I'm awful with words, as you can probably tell. I, I can't... I have... I have... You know, issues expressing myself through... It's like the the word, the feelings and the emotions of words are all there in my head. And then when, when I try to get them to go from my brain to my mouth, it, it all... It, I, it's... It comes out as a, as a mess. I mean, it's like a knotted ball of yarn. It, I, it's pretty awful, but... I mean, if, if, if I'm feeling angry or depressed or happy or if I want to die and I, I, those are the times when I, I need to express myself the most and it, picking up a camera and it, it, like channeling the emotions like through the lens is the easiest way for me to communicate with other people. And, and I love that it's it's that kind of medium that you don't need words. You you can look at the image and you you just you feel it, you know? Is that weird? Have I lost you yet? Anyway, moving on. Um I love poetry. I love reading knowledge. I, I always I wanna learn everything about everything. I'm so interested in so many things. Um and I, I think I, I think I like poetry the most because I can't write it for shit. I can't. I, I mean, I have some pretty bad like journals from when I was twelve of this, you know, just awful angsty teen poems, and they're, they're pretty awful. But I, I love reading other people's poetry. It's it's beautiful. I wish that I had that kind of talent. So um, props to all you writers out there. Uh, good for you. Keep, keep on, keeping on. <laughs> um, let's see, I, I make jewelry and I sell it on Etsy. It's, I, I'm a very crafty person. I, I love, um, just anything creative. I can, I, I can sew. I love sewing. Um, I, I, I can kind of paint. I, I don't really consider myself a painter per se, but I, I like to, you know, do little doodles and stuff. Um, I'm trying to learn knitting. I'd love to learn how to knit. I can crochet, but it, it kind of frustrates me and it, 
I feel like it takes so long to crochet something and um, my mom's been trying to get me to knit for years so she is mailing me some knitting needles and some yarn and you know like mac and cheese and cookies and you know all, all the stuff moms send their kids when they're away from home so hopefully I will be knitting in the next month or so um, Let's see, I am I'm gay, I'm openly out, proud, all of that good stuff. Um, I'm lucky to have such a supportive family. Um, my mom has been absolutely fantastic through, you know, the whole coming out and accepting and um, all of that kind of stuff. Um, I, I have, for, for the longest time, I, I, I wanted to be a photographer. You know, I, I wanted to, you know, travel the world and, and shoot, shoot, you know, maybe travel with a band and, you know, take, take pictures for them or, you know, open, open a camera shop or a portrait studio or, you know, you know, go, go raise awareness about, you know, issues that are important, you know, by, by photographing, um, them and lately I I think I, I've kind of changed my my goals in life um, I would love to work for for some something like the, the Trevor project I love I absolutely I think they are such an amazing amazing organization um, just the thing the the things they've the doors they've opened the, the lives they've saved, it's, it's amazed me. Um, and I'm very, very passionate about, um, the, the issues of, of teen suicide, especially amongst, uh, gay and lesbian, you know, kid, uh, transgender, bisexual, you know, kids, because I know when I was that age, it, it was very, it was very confusing. I mean, it's it's hard enough being 12 and 14 and 16 and, and trying to figure out who you are and who who you want to be and, and live up to the expectations of society. I mean, that's hard enough on, on kids, you know, but, but when you are different to such an extreme that you are gay or lesbian or, or transgender, bisexual, queer, you know, whatever, whatever, you know, you kind of category or label, whatever you, you know, fit into or don't fit into, you know, maybe, maybe you feel something different that there's not even a label for and that's okay. But I mean, to have to deal with that on top of, of trying to be a teenager, it, I, I know how hard it is and um, I just, I, I want to be a resource to, to kids like that, um, and, and just to let them know that, you know, they're not alone, there's, there's nothing wrong with you, um, you're beautiful, you're wonderful, and I, I don't really know what else to say other than there is absolutely nothing wrong with you um and it like I feel like it, it starts to get creepy when I talk like this but um I I honestly I I love all of you I mean and it's it's crazy to to feel such a love for somebody you you may not know but I, I really do, and it, it breaks my heart every time, you know, I, I read about another, another life that, you know, has been lost because that person felt lost or, or, or bullied, you know, or confused, you know, or they, they felt like, they, they were, you know, defected. There was something wrong with them. And I just, it's kind of crazy. And I, you know, I just, I want to save the world. 
I guess, basically. But, um, I, I can, I had planned on making another video about this whole issue because I'm at 15 minutes right now and this is like ridiculously long. None of you are going to watch it till the end. But, um, if you do, I, you're awesome. And I will, if you watch this to the end, you know, reply and I will give you a shout out on my next video just because to watch me for 15 minutes um, I, I wouldn't ask my worst enemy to do that because that, it, that's insane. But thank you to all of you guys who are following me. I appreciate it. I never expected to have this many people that interested in what I have to say. It's kind of shocking, honestly. But this has gotten insanely long. So I'm gonna go because I'm at 16 minutes now. Um, and it was nice talking to you. You should leave me some questions in my ask box, wherever it is. I'll put a link down there. <laughs> okay, that, okay. Anyway, I'll see you guys later.